वेलकम डेयर स्टूडेंट्स टू दिस प्रोग्राम डेयर स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट हेरन्स फर्मूला फ्रॉम क्लास नाइन मैथमेटिक्स बुक चैप्टर ट्वेल्व दिस इज पार्ट ट्वेल्व डेयर स्टूडेंट्स इन द अर्लियर सेशन वी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट दिस फॉर्मूला एंड हाउ टू फाइंड द एरिया ऑफ ए ट्राइंगल बाय यूजिंग द हेरन्स फॉर्मूला व्हेन द थ्री साइड्स आर गिवन हियर टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट एरिया ऑफ ए क्वालिटरल व्हेन लेंथ ऑफ फोर साइड्स एंड वन ऑफ द डायगोनल इज नोन हियर वी विल यूज this herons formula herons formula says that the area of triangle is square root of s into s minus a into s minus b into s minus c what are these a b c a b c are the sides of a triangle that is lengths of the sides of a triangle then what is s s is the semi perimeter of a triangle that means it is the half of the sum of the lengths of the sides now let's have some problem using this herons formula let's find the area of some quadrilaterals here in a quadrilateral abcd ab is equal to bc equal to 20 cm CD is equal to 16 cm DA equal to 12 cm if angle B is equal to 60 degree find the area of the quadrilateral let's see ABCD is the quadrilateral where AB is equal to BC angle b is 60 degree ab and bc both are of 20 cm cd is 16 cm and ad is 12 cm then where is the diagonal let's see if we join ac then in abc triangle angle b is 60 degree and ab is equal to bc so these two as angles that is angle bac and angle acb will be equal so each will of 60 degree measure so solution in triangle abc ab is equal to bc this implies angle bac is equal to angle acb but angle abc is equal to 60 degree this implies sum of these two is 120 and both are equal so each is bsc equal to acb is equal to 120 degree by 2 that is 60 degree now you see in this triangle abc all the angles are equal so this is a this is an equilateral triangle so this implies triangle abc is equilateral as abc triangle is equilateral this implies side ac is equal to 20 cm if side ac is 20 cm now we know how to find the area of equilateral triangle so by that we can say area of triangle abc is equal to root 3 by 4 into 20 square that is root 
इंटू फोर हंड्रेड बाई फोर दैट इज हंड्रेड रूट थ्री ना द वैल्यू ऑफ रूट थ्री इज वन पॉइंट सेवन थ्री टू सो वी कैन से दिस इज वन हंड्रेड सेवन थ्री पॉइंट टू सेंटीमीटर स्क्वेर ना लेट्स फाइंड द एरिया ऑफ ट्राइंगल ए डी सी सो फॉर ट्राइंगल ए डी सी लेट स्मॉल ए इज इक्वल टू ट्वेल्व सेंटीमीटर बी इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी सेंटीमीटर एंड सी इक्वल टू सिक्सटीन सेंटीमीटर देन व्हाट इज एस एस इज इक्वल टू ट्वेल्व प्लस ट्वेंटी प्लस सिक्सटीन बाई टू हेयर इट इज ट्वेंटी प्लस सिक्सटीन थर्टी सिक्स प्लस टुवेल्व दैट इज फोर्टी एट फोर्टी एट बाई टू दैट इज ट्वेंटी फोर सेंटीमीटर नाउ वी हैव टू फाइंड दिस एरिया ऑफ द ट्राइंगल ए डी सी Now, area of triangle ADC is equal to square root of S into S minus A into S minus B into S minus C. That is square root of here S is twenty four, so twenty four into twenty four minus A is twelve into twenty four minus B is twenty into twenty four minus C is sixteen. This gives square root of twenty four into twenty four minus twelve gives twelve. Twenty four minus twenty gives four, and twenty four minus sixteen gives eight. Now let's see here. As twelve is here, and this is multiple of twelve, we can for to solve easily to find the square root easily. Let's write this as twelve into two. Again, this is twelve into here it is four. Here also in eight we have four into two, so let's keep four as four, and in place of eight we can write four into two. So in this case we have two twelve. So square root of for two. Square root of twelve and twelve, we can take one twelve. Similarly, for two four, we have to take one four, and for two twos, we have to take one two. This gives ninety six centimeter square. Now earlier, the area of ABC was twenty was. Says one hundred seventy three point two centimeter square. Now this area of triangle ADC is ninety six centimeter square. Square. So area of quadrilateral ABCD is equal to this. One hundred seventy-three point two plus this ninety-six. So the sum is two six nine point two centimeter square. So thus, by using the Heron's formula, we can find the quadrilateral of such question. Let's see another question. A park in the shape of A quadrilateral ABCD has angle C is equal to 90 degree, AB is equal to 9 meter, BC is equal to 12 meter, CD is 5 meter, and AD is 8 meter. How much area does it occupy?
here the angle C is 90 degree. So, A, B, C, D, here angle C is 90 degree, AB is 9 centimeter, BC is 12 meter, AB is 9 meter, BC is 12 meter, CD is 5 meter, and AD is 8 meter. So, here there is no diagonal. We have to find the diagonal. How to find the diagonal? If we join BD, this BCD is a right, uh, right angle triangle. So, by using Pythagoras theorem, we can find the hypotenuse. So, the solution is like this in triangle BCD angle C is equal to 90 degree and BC is 12 meter, CD is 5 meter and we know that BD is equal to square root of BC square plus CD square. Now, what is BC? BC is 12. So, you can write 12 square plus in place of CD, we can write 5 square. So, here we have square root of 12 square plus 5 square. This gives 144 plus 25 that is square root of 169 that is 13 meter. So, BD is now 13 meter. So, area of triangle BCD is equal to, you see, as 12 and 5 are perpendicular to each other. That means, we can say the area is half into 5 into 12 that is 30 meter square. For triangle ABD, we have three sides. A is given as 13 meter, B is given as 8 meter and C is given as 9 meter. So, what is S? S is equal to 13 plus 8 plus 9 by 2. This is 9 plus 8, 17 plus 13, 30 by 2, that is 15 meter. If triangle ABD, in triangle ABD, semi perimeter is 15, so we can say area of triangle ABD is equal to square root of here S is 15 into S minus A is 13 into S minus B is 8 into 15 minus C here is the C is 9. So, in place of A, B, C, we substitute 13, 8 and 9. Now, this gives square root of 15 into 2 into 5 into 7 into 6. Now, we can say in place of 15, we can write 3 into 5, in place of 2, it is 2, in place of 7, it is 7, and in place of 6, we can write 2 into 3. So, square root of 3 into 5 into 2 into 7 into 2 into 3. So, here we have, we have here 2 3s and 2 2s. 
so for that we can take 1 2 and 1 3 then in square root we have 5 and 7 so that product is 35 that gives 6 into value of root 35 is 5.91 so the product is 35.46 so we can find the area of so area of the quadrilateral A, B, C, D is equal to area of triangle B, C, D plus area of triangle A, B, D. And area of triangle B, C, D is equal to 30 meter square and area of triangle A, B, D is 35.5. 46 meter square that gives 65.46 meter square. Thus, we can find the area of a quadrilateral. Now, you see, let us have another question. Find the area of a quadrilateral ABCD in which AB 3 centimeter, BC 4 centimeter. CD 4 cm, DA 5 cm and AC 5 cm. ABCD is a quadrilateral in which AB is 3 cm, BC is 4 cm, CD is 4 cm, AD is 5 cm and AC is also 5 cm. Now see, in this quadrilateral we have 4 sides and a diagonal are given. Now what is the solution? If we look at this triangle, we have in triangle ABC, we have 5 square is equal to 3 square plus 4 square. That means AC square is equal to AB square plus BC square. That means triangle ABC is right angle triangle this implies area of triangle ABC is equal to half into 3 into 4 that is 6 centimeter square now for triangle a C D A is equal to 5, B equal to 5 and C is equal to 4. All these are centimeters. So what is S? S is equal to 5 plus 5 plus 4 by 2 that is 14 by 2 that is 7 centimeter. If S is 77 centimeter then what is area. So, area of triangle SCD is equal to square root of S, S is 7 into S minus A means 7 minus 5 then 7 minus 5 and then 7 minus 4 that gives 7 
into two into two into three square root of this. This gives two into square root of twenty one. Now we can find the value of root twenty one. This is equal to two into four point five eight. That gives nine point one six centimeter square. Earlier we have find that area of triangle ABC is six centimeter square. So area of quadrilateral ABCD is equal to six plus nine point one six centimeter square. That is fifteen point one six centimeter square. Thus, by using this Heron's formula, we could uh, solve another problem. Let's see another question. A triangle. And a parallelogram have the same base and the same area. If the sides of the triangle are 26 centimeter, 28 centimeter, and 30 centimeter, and the parallelogram stands on the base 28 centimeter, find the height of the parallelogram. In triangle, say ABC, the length of the sides are. Twenty-six centimeter, twenty-eight centimeter, and thirty centimeter. The area of this and a parallelogram are equal. Let the parallelogram is like this with the same base, say D E. Now we can find the area of this triangle. And area of triangle is same as the area of the parallelogram. So for triangle ABC, say A equal to twenty-eight, B equal to thirty, and C equal to twenty-six. All these are in centimeter. So. Semi perimeter S is equal to twenty eight centimeter plus thirty centimeter plus twenty six centimeter by two. That is eighty four by two or forty two centimeter. If S is forty two centimeter, then area of triangle ABC is equal to square root of S. That is forty two. Into forty two minus twenty eight into forty two minus thirty into forty two minus twenty six. This gives square root of forty two into this gives fourteen and this one is twelve into forty two minus twenty six. Is sixteen. Now you see here one fourteen is there, so we can write this forty two as fourteen and three. So fourteen into three into fourteen, and this twelve can be written as two into three into two, and this sixteen is as can be written as four into four. So we have two fourteens. So fourteen and two three. So for that one three, and we have two twos. So take one two, and we have two fours. That is to take one four, and product of this is equal to three thirty six centimeter square. And the area of this triangle is same as. The area of the parallelogram BCDE. So area of parallelogram BCDE is 
बी सी डी ई इज इक्वल टू थ्री थर्टी सिक्स सेंटीमीटर स्क्वेर एंड वी नो दैट एरिया ऑफ पैलोलोग्राम इज इक्वल टू हाइट इन टू बेस सो प्रोडक्ट ऑफ दिस टू इज थ्री थर्टी सिक्स सेंटीमीटर स्क्वेर सो हाइट इन टू व्हाट इज बेस बेस इज ट्वेंटी एट सेंटीमीटर हियर सो ट्वेंटी एट इज इक्वल टू थ्री थर्टी सिक्स दैट गिवस हाइट इज इक्वल टू थ्री थर्टी सिक्स बाय ट्वेंटी एट दैट इज ट्वेल्व सेंटीमीटर दस वी कैन फाइंड द हाइट ऑफ द पैलोलोग्राम लेट्स हैव अनदर क्वेश्चन द क्वेश्चन सेज ए ट्रायंगुलर फील्ड विथ साइड्स टू फोर्टी मीटर टू हंड्रेड मीटर थ्री सिक्सटी मीटर इज एडजसेंट टू अनदर ट्रायंगल फील्ड ट्रायंगुलर फील्ड विथ साइड्स टू फोर्टी मीटर थ्री ट्वेंटी मीटर फोर हंड्रेड मीटर इफ शी ग्रोज पोटैटोज इन द एंटायर फील्ड हाउ मच एरिया हैज बीन यूज फॉर पोटैटोज यू हैव टू एक्सप्रेस इट इन हेक्टर्स एंड वी नो दैट वन हेक्टर इज इक्वल टू टेन थाउजेंड मीटर स्क्वेर हियर द फिगर इज लाइक दिस ए बी सी इन हुईज द डायमेंस आर से थ्री हंड्रेड सिक्सटी टू हंड्रेड एंड टू हंड्रेड फोर्टी दीज आर इन मीटर्स एंड अनदर एडजस्टेंट फील्ड हैज डायमेंशन टू फोर्टी टू फोर्टी फोर हंड्रेड एंड थ्री हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी दीज आर इन मीटर्स सो इन दिस फिगर इन ट्रायंगल ए बी सी से ए इक्वल टू टू हंड्रेड मीटर बी इक्वल टू थ्री हंड्रेड सिक्सटी मीटर एंड सी इक्वल टू टू हंड्रेड फोर्टी मीटर सो व्हाट इज एस एस इज इक्वल टू टू हंड्रेड प्लस थ्री सिक्सटी प्लस टू फोर्टी बाई टू दैट गिवस एट हंड्रेड बाई टू दैट गिवस फोर हंड्रेड सो व्हाट इज द एरिया लेट इट बी एरिया वन एरिया वन इज स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ दिस एस इज फोर हंड्रेड इंटू फोर हंड्रेड माइनस टू हंड्रेड इंटू फोर हंड्रेड माइनस थ्री सिक्सटी इंटू फोर हंड्रेड माइनस टू फोर्टी दैट गिवस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ हेयर इट इज फोर हंड्रेड एंड फोर हंड्रेड माइनस टू हंड्रेड इज टू हंड्रेड फोर हंड्रेड माइनस थ्री सिक्सटी इज फोर्टी एंड फोर हंड्रेड माइनस टू हंड्रेड फोर्टी इज वन हंड्रेड सिक्सटी ना यू सी फोर हंड्रेड इज सेल्फ इज अ स्क्वायर नंबर सो यू कैन राइट इट एज ट्वेंटी इंटू ट्वेंटी इन प्लेस ऑफ टू टू हंड्रेड वी कैन राइट ट्वेंटी इंटू टेन इन प्लेस ऑफ फोर्टी वी कैन राइट ट्वेंटी इंटू टू इन प्लेस ऑफ वन हंड्रेड सिक्सटी वी कैन राइट दैट फोर इंटू फोर इंटू टेन ना हाउ मेनी ट्वेंटीज आर हियर वी हैव फोर ट्वेंटी सो टेक टू ट्वेंटीज ट्वेंटी इंटू ट्वेंटी हाउ मेनी टेन्स आर देयर यू सी टू टेन्स so we can take one ten here we have two fours are there so we can write one four and we have only 
1 2 so we can write square root of 2 so from this we get it is 16000 into 1.41 say up to two decimal places value of root 2 is 1.41 so this will become 2256.00 now let's find the area of the other triangle in triangle ACD say here also we have three sides let them also write ABC so for this triangle ACD A is 240 meter B is 320 meter and C is 400 meter now S is equal to 240 plus 320 plus 400 that is 960 meter by 2 so this gives 480 meter then what is area 2 that is square root of 480 into 480 minus 240 into 480 minus 400 into 480 minus 320 you see here it is 480 and 480 minus 240 gives 240 480 minus 400 gives 80 and 480 minus 320 gives 160. You see here 240 is there and 480 is same as 240 into 2. So we can write 240 into 2 and 240 is as it is. And here it is 160 is twice 80. So in place of 80 we let it be 80 and 160 as 80 into 2 so square root so we have 240 into 80 and we have one pair of 2's so we can write 2 so this gives the value as 38400 meter square Now you see, we have two areas, one is 22560 meter square and the other is 38400 meter square. So what is, what is the total area? So total area is equal to 38400 plus 22560 this much meter square that is 60960 meter this is we have to express this in hectare so 1 hectare is equal to 10,000 meter square so this implies this area is equal to 60960 by 10,000 that is 6.096 hectares so here we found that the field which is used to grow potato is of area 6.096 hectares. Dear students, today we learn how to use Heron's formula to find the 
area of a quadrilateral by splitting it into two triangles. Hope you understand. Have a good day. Thank you.